Describe the person that Novak used to be when he was addicted. <laughs> you go first. <laughs> well. Take it easy. It's fucking crazy. <laughs> The only thing I can think of is once we moved to our house that we were in, that we're in now, which was in 2001. So all we need to do is snag them from Paris and then go all over Europe. I got warrants. I can't go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> He's telling the truth. I think it was probably 2002 <laughs> or three <laughs> that Bam asked Novak to come and live with us because he had nowhere else to go. His mother had basically said, you can't be here. She was done with him for that um, time. Now you're talking. So he came to the house and I think that that was a, it was a good thing for a while, but then things started disappearing. We were suspicious all along, but then uh, Fairman called and says, hey, Brandon, Novak keeps bringing element stuff and watches from the BAM's watch company. Does BAM know this? And we said no. So that's what BAM says, no, Rack, you've been doing all this. So that put it into that. So then, actually, every time that he would go to Baltimore and said he was going to go home and visit family, um, I had to stop him and say, empty your backpack. And he, he was loaded with all BAM stuff. 